hello and welcome to the learning square in this video we will look at the low pass butterworth filtering in the Fourier domain now this lecture is in continuation with the previous one we had created a function for high pass butterworth filter so we will make another one now we will make a function I will again take the output as out name my function as butter LP inputs are going to be my image D and N these are the same parameters we used in the last lecture so in case you have problems you can just go back and see for yourself now a low pass filter can be created by just a simple operation saying 1 minus the high pass filter wherein now our high pass filter was butter HP which we had made in the last class the inputs were same and this should be it so I'll save this now to apply this filter I will again follow the same pattern read the cameraman image I can call a variable LP and assign it as butter LP with this A I can take D naught as 15 that's going to be my radii and the first order filter again the same steps apply the Fourier transform on my image so FFT shift FFT2 that is taking the Fourier transform of my image and shifting it to the center now I will apply this low pass filter so it's simple multiplication so like we've been saying convolution in the spatial domain is a simple multiplication in the frequency domain now once this is done I can simply say take the inverse of this I have T2 take the inverse Fourier transform of this transformed image and I will use the IFFT show function to see my result so a low pass filter has been applied here you can see it the image is a little blurred you can play around with this you can increase the D value you can change the N value and see the results for yourself so this brings us to the end of this lecture see you in the next one thank you